Gorgons. What can you do? You called upon your humble court musician, as I understand, Lord Hades, sir. Referring to myself, of course. Well, Orpheus, if you're quite finished with your little stint within the depths of Tartarus, I'd like to ask again. Play us a song already. Or else next time I'll not be quite so charitable with your punishment. Oh, that. I must apologize again, Lord Hades, sir. For I'm afraid that I've no wish to sing as yet. In spite of your persuasiveness, even. And that, um, is my final word upon the subject at this time. Is that so? Why, then I'll go ahead and wait. I've all the patience in the world. He's in trouble. More pets? More pets. right now about something so maybe you could stay away from him or i could tell him you're not here that's quite all right do sir i'm not afraid of him and neither should you be you're the best help he's ever found just uh, just doing my job here prince Achilles, i sometimes i fear that father if he learns that you've been aiding me that he will not be generous with you. Don't worry about me, lad. Your father's still getting caught up with work that I created for him in my mortal days. Besides, there's nothing he can take from me. We have a mutual arrangement, he and I. I hope you're right. Nix, do you know anything about a softly spoken gentle being under the guise of chaos? They approached me recently and offered me a boon of sorts. Primordial chaos. Indeed, I know them well. They must have taken interest in your quest. I would advise that you beware their offerings, though know that chaos, whilst a trickster, is not a deceiver. I understand, I think. <laughs> What are your sisters up to these days, Meg? I've not seen them around. We're stretched a little thin, as you can see. Some kind of war up there meant lots of business here. I'm left to hold the line and deal with you. Yes. Pal, thanks again for that nectar bottle from before. Stuff just goes right through me like you won't believe. Though I hope you're not going around giving that stuff away to every bozo you know. What, Skelly? You worry something bad is going to happen if I express a bit of generosity from time to time through our somewhat illicit gift-giving custom around here? No, I'm worried you'll be wasting your time. If you give that stuff away, don't expect to get anything back. Well, not after the first time, anyway. <coughs> I'm just saying, don't get your hopes up. Maybe I just want to show thanks to my friends for its own sake. <laughs> sure! Can't do that.
Ready. This is where you belong. You feel out of place? Where would you even go? What would you have me do? Your place is here. My place is with my mother. lighter than before. Heads up. Hey, go. Desperately. At first, I thought you simply lacked in patience, but now I see it's urgency that drives you. What is it that you're after, really? why Lord Hades would have kept your mere existence hidden from us all this time. Perhaps he knew that once you met us, you would stop at nothing to come seek us out. I'm all worked up. you in a trance already, Zagreus? Or might I offer you the blessing of Olympus to intensify her catastrophic power with my own?
again. Stop him, Riches, now! Made them mad. At least I'm picking up some coin. Good. Danke schön. Already, Zag, or I'll keep killing you each time you come. I have some bad news for you, Meg. Little by little, I'm getting stronger. That may be so, but you'll never. Watching the pool of sticks, you know? 
the ripples in the blood and everything, and sometimes somebody pops out of there like you. House staff and guests of honor, no one else. I sign them in and help make sure they have a pleasant stay. Well, sign me in then. Grown any wiser yet? Have you yet satisfied your foolish urges? Perhaps a lashing from the Fury's whips would set you straight. I had it out with them already, thanks. Such nonsense. First you defy me openly, and now you lie. On my next meeting with the Furies, we'll have a word about all this, you rest assured. I could be there to see your face. You are the best, you know that, don't you, boy? Oh, um, hello. You're much too modest, Lord Achilles, for someone with such a number of heroic deeds and glorious decapitations to his name. You ought to be more like ever boastful Zacharias and talk it up some more. Oh, fear not, Orpheus. I was quite boastful of my day. And would you look at where it got me? Besides, I've not the imagination to come up with tales as tall as those of our Prince Zagreus. What can I say? I try. You have met most of your Olympian relatives by now, child. Although the power of their blessings is fleeting here, they shall continue to support you, as long as necessary. They all still think I'm headed to join them on Olympus. That's why they're helping me. They are helping you because you are family. Family with whom they do not yet have a complicated past. It's getting complicated pretty fast. <laughs> not as comfy as it looks. Oh, um, so, hi, Prince. So, is there anything I can get you? Or maybe tidy up some more, or... I just... Oh, a uh, drink sometimes sounds wonderful, do so. Maybe tomorrow? What? I mean, it's no big deal. I mean, forget I asked. Do so? Good. Hey, you're getting pretty strong there, pal. Though I am being paid to tell you that. But not being paid to not tell you that last part. I have to ask you something, mate. What do you even need the pay for, anyway? That, pal, is nobody's business but my own. Besides, it's impolite discussing money all the time. Now back to beating me to powder. This one. Twin fists of Melfon. Our strength combined surely cannot be stopped. Whoa, those are some paws. <laughs> and we're back. I'm ready. Thank the fates. Yeah, who was? You are the son of Night herself. 
they say. A fascinating character, ill-liked upon Olympus, although I myself have always longed to meet her. If it isn't you. Hey, sir. You know, Prince, it's been good not having to see those Fury sisters quite as much lately. The main <coughs> what's her name? She's on your case now, isn't she? You mean Megara? She's on my case, all right. Under strict orders not to let me out of Tartarus. I guess that means you've got yourself a break. About damn time they gave one to you, sir. He does it. All mine.
This is my fight. See here. Hmm. I'll take this one. Still. Grant me strength. Hello, Meg. <laughs> What's that you're holding, Xandrius? Please tell me that you didn't steal the most dangerous, unstable artifact filled shut within your father's vault. Um, it wasn't I who stole them, if that's any reassurance to you, Meg. You are a hopeless fool. You cannot possibly know what you're doing with those things.
find you. Do bathe yourself in magma when you get to Asphodel. Worth it. Closer to the surface. Yes. Ah, oh, this heat. Spreaders. What? Singing? Here? Come on in. Okay. Hey, you must be the Hades kid. How's it going then, your royal majesty? Nice to meet you. I'm Eurydice. What brings a big, important guy like you up to a place like this? Hi there. No need for formalities. I'm Zagreus. Just heading out on some official business, past the menacing Bone Hydra. Don't mean to be rude, though I'm in a bit of a rush. Well, don't you have your hands full, hon? I'll let you go. But there's one rule in my place, which is... Nobody leaves here empty-handed. You got that? So take your pick. fists.
Malfarn grows stronger. Moving on. Gorgons. Keep it up. Oh, blasted witches got me. 